Hi guys, Everyday Knife Guy here with another simple knot tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to do a clove hitch. Um, so with your working end of your rope, we're going to take the object that you want to create the hitch on and you're going to pass the rope over that and back round towards you. Now as you bring the rope back towards you, make sure it comes on the right hand side of the piece that you took over in your first turn. We're going to take our working end back over the rope, quite loosely this time, and we're going to make sure when we go over that we actually cross over our first turn of the rope. And we're going to take our working end now and we're going to go back up under the second turn that we just made. So your working end comes up on the left of that first turn we made around the rope. Okay, so you can see the cross shape there. So you should have on the back. And now as we pull that tight, you'll see the cross, since she's down on top of her working end, pinches it in place and the harder we pull, basically the tighter that, that hitch gets. Okay, And that's about as tight as it's going to get. It's really pinched that down there. Alright, there's the back. There's the front. We'll do that one more time. So take your working end and go over the object you want to hitch to. Come back towards you on the right hand side of that first turn. Go back over again, loosely, and make sure your rope now crosses over the first turn. And we're going to bring a working end back up under, and we're going to go under that crossing piece. Grab our working end there, pull tight on our rope, pull on both ends, and the tighter we pull, the more that hitch cinches down. So there you are guys, that's the clove hitch. Hope that was useful. Please subscribe for more knot videos coming, and check out the rest of this playlist for lots more tutorials. Thanks for watching.